This follows the massacre in a suburban area called Bulka, where hundreds of civilians were murdered by Russian troops. A vigil for those victims was held at our capital tonight, and Marissa Armas was there. We're here at the state capitol where you can see that dozens of Colorado Ukrainians gathered to honor all of those civilians who were recently killed this week in Ukraine. Many people came draped in their flags. Many of them also brought flowers. Unlike other gatherings at the Colorado State Capitol, Friday's event brought a somber feeling. If you ask anyone like Ukrainian who has relatives, who has family, they feel wounded. One by one, Ukrainians lit candles honoring hundreds of civilians who were recently killed in Bucha and other parts of the country. Ukrainian officials accused Russia of committing war crimes and genocide on its people. This is not something Ukrainians wanted. It's a mix of anger and frustration. For Taras Overchuk, who still has family in the country, every day brings anxiety. He hopes to see other governments step up to intervene. I think it should move everyone. Uh, it's in, in, and Americans as well. We should understand that. And organizers say that the best thing you can do to help right now is by making a monetary donation. For more on that, you can visit our website. In Denver, Marissa Adamas, covering Colorado First. Marissa.